Hello, I just like to make a short video um, appearing all over on the internet right now and on Amazon and on eBay we have what, what they call the generic memory cards and this is the packaging that they come in it's this blue and white packaging and these usually come from China and uh, this card here I don't know see if we can see if we can get it to focus here There, if you can see that, this card is labeled as a 128 gig card, a micro SD card, and it comes with the micro SD adapter. Well, I paid $11 for this on Amazon, and I knew I wasn't going to be getting a 128 gig card for $11, but I was curious to see just what I would be getting uh, for my money. I know I read most of the reviews were negative, saying that the card... You know, it wouldn't hold data or it would corrupt your data and so forth. There was some positive reviews where they said it was working good and everything. However, I think those were written by the seller or someone working with the seller. Well, I got this card in today and I put it in my computer and I formatted it and it read as uh, 29 gigs, which means it's actually a 32 gig card. And it's, it's relabeled as a 128 gig card. So obviously this is, this is a deception on the part of this seller. Um, labeling something as 128 gigs, it's actually 32 gigs. This is misrepresentation. And I don't believe that Amazon should be selling a product like this. When they find out that you know it is misrepresented, I think they should take it off, take it down off the site because... Uh, they shouldn't be selling something from a, a dishonest seller like this. Um, I didn't try to put any data on the card because I'm I <clears throat> I'm afraid that if you put anything important on here, it'll be corrupted and you won't be able to read it. So I don't recommend buying this. And I don't if you if you have bought it, I don't recommend using it because uh, you really can't trust something like this. You don't know where they got these. They, these are probably rejects from, from a manufacturer that, that were defective. They probably bought them up and relabeled them as 128 gig cards. And, uh, you know, somebody over in China is laughing all the way to the bank right now. So, uh, again, generic memory cards, I don't recommend them. I don't recommend you buy them. And if you have, I don't recommend you use them. If you want a real 128 gig card, I would recommend saving up some money and getting a sand disc. I know they're expensive. They're $109.99 right now on Amazon, but at least you know you're getting a brand name card and you know that uh, it's not going to corrupt all your data and so forth. So don't don't fall for this uh, bullshit genetic card thing. If something sounds too good to be true, it usually is. So. Uh, you know, don't be suckered in by these ripoff artists selling these bogus cards. Um, as always, comment, rate, and subscribe. If by chance you've bought one of these generic cards and it actually is the capacity stated and it's actually working for you, I'd like to hear about it because I don't believe that this is the case. I think this is, these are all bogus claims. And uh, if you bought one of these and it's the right capacity that it's claimed that it's working please comment about it comment rate of subscribe and thanks for watching my videos and we'll see you again